Hey guys and welcome back to another video. My name is Saif and in this video I'm gonna show you step by step how you can easily use Alchemir to design and customize surveys to collect and analyze data for your own business. So let's see how. First you need to create an account from here. I will just log in to Alchemir survey and Alchemir workflow. Now I will insert my email. And password. Login. And here we are. So basically to start your own survey, you can go to survey from here and you can click on create new. Then you can insert the name of your survey. Let's say tutorial, feedback, and check on this and start building. Now here is your dashboard in which you can build your own survey. So first of all, let's start adding questions to our survey. This is done by pressing on add new question here. And here you will find multiple types of questions. We will add a question from every type of the accessible or the open types. So first of all, the ready buttons. This is simply um, one choice question so that you can answer this question by choosing only one choice. So let's choose it. And let's say the question is, how do you find our tutorial and the questions are excellent good and I will add another option bad then save question now let's add a new question from here and choose the type as drop down menu this is the same exact idea of the previous question however it, it, it's a different format so if I chose drop down menu and I inserted the same question, which is how do you find our tutorial? I can insert the same questions, the same answers here. Good. Bad. So basically I will insert the same question, but with different formats so that you can explore the different types of questions that Alchemir can provide to your own survey. So let's press on save question here. And now let's add another question. Here I will choose check boxes. So this is basically the same as the previous. However, you can choose more than an option. So let's say for example, how do you find our tutorial? And I will insert good needs improvement bad. And now I can save question. Then I can add another question and I will choose the type as text box. Here it's like a, a complete question, so I can see, I can say. How do you find our tutorial? And I can write here, I think your tutorial is a tutorial. And how it will, and this is how it will be shown. So I basically identify the field before and after the missing text. And now let's add another question and choose essay. How do you find this tutorial? And now the, the person or the applicant for this survey has to answer in a long answer. I can also activate this to make it required or deactivated and press on save 
add another question. Here, this is the same as the previous. However, it requires an insert of an email. And this is the same, but it requires the insert of a date. So let's press on this. When do you want to subscribe? And I will just leave these two empty. Done. Add new question. So these were the basic ones. The following are intermediate and expert. However, we will not use them because this is a beginner tutorial. However, I'm just going to show you how the other questions look like. So here you can insert a rating. Here you can insert a number, percentage. And the rest are closed. So this is pretty much it. Now let's cancel this question. And now let's preview our page by pressing on preview here. And here you can answer this tutorial or this survey. So let's say excellent, for example, choose excellent. Here I will choose good, but needs improvement. And here I will say excellent. The tutorial is excellent. And here I will answer just the date. And then press on submit. And once I am done, it will show me this thank you page. And this is pretty much it. So this is how you can build your own survey. You can also control the style from here. So you can add like a logo and it's pretty much simple. All what you need to do is to just press on logo and you can add your image from your device. You can also add a background, a page, header, button, text and more. So it's pretty much self-explanatory. You can also test your own survey from here and you can see these parameters. So our tutorial is two minutes long. The fatigue square is a, a, an identification of how hard your uh, survey is and how tiring it can be. And the accessibility gauge here shows how, shows how, mu how much your survey is accessible. So if your survey contains any elements that are not ac accessible, you will find this gauge is different. And here you can share it. And here you can see the results and here you can access all more tools. So this is how you can easily cre create your own customized surveys with Alchemir. So that's it for this video guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial. If you like this video, press on like, then subscribe to our channel. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next videos. Until then, take care and goodbye.